It's Wednesday, and that means we're focusing on health. We have Dave Cobb here from Miracles Rehabilitation for Wellness Wednesday. Dave, you're here to teach us about 3D functional strength training and conditioning. So my first question is, what is 3D? Right. Well, one of the first most important things to realize is understanding the complexities of how the human body truly functions, how every body part, in fact, every muscle, every tendon, every ligament, and most importantly, every joint in the body moves in three dimensions. Now, three-dimensional rehabilitation and strength training is something um, of a buzzword in, in town, in fact, across the country. A lot of the physical therapists that I work with um, and, and are trained in understanding how the body functions, but when we talk about three-dimensional movement, it's trying to break that down so we can develop strategies to implement some of our techniques to better help our patients and our clients. And it's really easy to modify exercises to make them 3D. Can you show us some? Well, sure. I think one of the first most important things is understanding the three planes of motion which make up that 3D movement pattern. Um, if we thought about the first plane of motion, kind of think about movement forward and backward. We call that the sagittal plane. The side-to-side -side movement is called the frontal plane. And then there's the third and maybe even the most important movement pattern called the transverse plane. We can take those components and move them into uh, sort of a, a synergy we call safety syntaxes. These are positions that we can put our body into to move in all three planes of motion to better train those body parts and how they truly function in life. Now, for instance, if we were to take a common lunge, most of everybody, and in fact, if you think of a lunge conjured up in your mind, you'd move in this, what we would call the sagittal plane. Correct. We can also take that concept of 3D motion and move sideways or in the frontal plane, and even more importantly, train our patients to move in a rotational plane of motion, which is that all-important transverse plane. And very quickly, what are some of the benefits of doing 3D exercises? Well, as the body truly functions in three dimensions, in all of its parts, we better utilize the body how it's truly meant to function. Therefore, we don't leave anything left to chance. All of the body parts are actually utilized in every exercise that we perform. All right. Thank you, Dave. This is Dave Cobb, and you can find out more about 3D exercises at Miracle Rehabilitation. And coming up, Mr. Food is back in the kitchen today, lucky for us. Coming up, a tasty recipe we're sure to enjoy.